Hey everybody, this is Eric Clark's Travel Videos. I'm here in Novosad and I'm going to the fortress. So I'll take you over to the fortress um, and I'll show you the fortress. What's, what's the name of this fortress? Uh, Petro Varadin. Petro Varadin. Petro Varadin. Petro Varadin is the name of the fortress. That's where I'm going to take it. Thanks everybody. Bye. So to get to the fortress, you have to cross the Danube from where I'm at. And so the Danube is... Hi puppy. He had a growth under his arm. Anyway, um, that's the Danube and that's where I'm crossing. So I gotta, I gotta cross the river. So it should be a, <laughs> a hike. And I think that sign, uh, maybe it doesn't say the name of the fortress. Oh well. I'm walking it. Bye, everybody. All right. Well, here's the Danube River, and there's the fortress. Pretty amazing. It's really a big river. You know, I've crossed the Danube before, but. Uh, you know, most of the places I see it, it's pretty narrow, but this looks pretty, pretty expansive. Anyway, that's the tower or the, the fortress. And that tower over there, you see that tower? That's pretty famous too. And I'll get over there and show you that as well. I'll try to hold this stable so you can see it. Let me back up a titch so we can get a good view. How's that look? Perfect. All right, so we got across. Now, this bridge is the one that lights up. The night, it lights up with white every night, but on special occasions, they've got all sorts of lights, red, blue, green, all sorts of different things, and they'll strobe it and do stuff like that. But uh, it's pretty amazing. At night, it's, it certainly stands out, so. All right, well, I'm gonna walk on over and I'll see you guys there. <laughs> Hurry up, you're walking slow. Bye. All right, well, I made it across the river and that's the fortress up there. Now, <laughs> I gotta figure out how to get inside. And you can see people up there and you can see a little person sitting right there on the edge. And you can see the people up on that edge too in the clock. But uh, they, don't, they don't have an arrow that says how to get there. Uh, so, so it says fortress and it says straight ahead so I guess I'm gonna go straight ahead all right everybody I'll see you inside Bye. well I kind of made it this far the little buildings are really cute I love all the different colors too it's just amazing anyway so it looks like it's gonna be a climb <laughs> here we go double road down uh, you know the stairs are not uh, they're not even and they're certainly not uh, not an easy clean holy crap Whew. yeah this is going to be a minute so you probably don't want to be hearing me breathing heavy trying to climb all these darn stairs and I'm already dripping. After yesterday's rain, the humidity is like 90%. Which let's ask here. Is the fortress this way or this way? This way. This way. Oh, better. Okay, follow. All right, so it's this way. All right. And the stairs really. Need some work. That's a great view, actually. Hi, right, everybody. I'll see you at the top, maybe. <laughs> Bye. All right. I thought I'd come back here and do a video from this part because it's kind of clean. Look at the, you can see the walls all overgrown, which is kind of interesting.
That's a pretty picture too. These stairs are better, well, <laughs> almost. I can't even see in there. So let's go out here first. Oh, mud. Let's not see the mud. And I think this is where that guy was at. Wow. Uh, <laughs> no rails, no anything. Whew. All right, everybody. Bye bye. Okay. Here's the tunnel. Kind of interesting. And doors. Cool. All right, everybody. Made it to the top. And there's a bar or something. Well, I think I know where I'm going to sit down and have a beer. Maybe. It looks like there's shops all over this fort. It's a good place to hang out. The owner of my uh, Airbnb that I'm in here currently, they offer fishing expeditions for like eight hours, a full day. They bring lunch, supply the boat, supply the gear, supply the gas, supply sodas and beers and everything else you want, 100 euros. And I think about it, but I don't know that I want to spend eight hours out there. You can see the old bridge here, I guess. They're really tall walls. That's a long way down there. Whew. All right. Well, I guess I'll keep walking a bit. I'm already sweating. Have I ever had that kind of beer? Nixico? Nixico. Mexico. I guess these are all leftovers after the six feet separation kind of thing, huh?
All right, well, I'll stop walking and carrying you guys around. I'm sure you don't want to see me walking. All right, I'll move on. Bye, bye, bye. So the castle grounds are enormous. They go here and all the way around, and it looks like even way over there. You can see all that? And you can see the wall right here. I mean, it looks like it takes up, and there's cars everywhere. It's huge. And it looked like it had a moat at one time. Because you can see over this thing, too. Amazing. This looks like an air hole, so there must be something underneath me. Look at that little gate entrance right there. It looks like it's got two walls to it, too. See the car going through there? So there must be a tunnel underneath me here, huh? Paula. I guess we know why they call it a fortress, huh? That's some nice glasses. Over this wall. More fortress. That is one big bee. Can you see my finger next to it? I mean, he's a he's a big boy, and I'm not even close yet. Huh? Sorry. ADHD means I get to be distracted. Ah. I can zoom back out, huh? Cute. I think you can eat those, right? I think I saw it on dual survival ones. How'd you get in here, huh? Pretty elaborate uh, fortress, actually. I saw some guy with an ice chest. Maybe that's what they do, is the locals come up here and have picnics in the shade and hang out.
Because there's a lot of cars up here too. Huh, I wonder what's up here. Excuse me, what's the name of this fortress? Petrovaradin. Say it one more time. Petrovaradin. Petrovaradin. Okay. Varadin. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you, Fala. Man, I just, you know, I hear them say it and I still can't get it right. And I think he's like the fifth person I've asked. I told you about them eating ice cream. More ice cream. All right. I guess I'll go in here. Bye, right, everybody. I made it to the top. Thanks for coming along to the fortress with me and, uh, and enjoying the walk and uh, <laughs> the views. Amazing place. Bye, everybody.